Alright, welcome to episode 12 of Gorn Starborn Dark Cloud 2 playthrough. Off of the recordings, I did talk to... Wait a minute. It's not time for me to be here. I actually need to take some pictures of things. Jurex nose, Jurex eye, tree... There's no mall here. Oh, I was trying to get a picture of Withered Jurek. I think it's not here in the future. It's this Jurek. There we go. While I was off the recording, Monica talked to me after we got a Geostone from the very next area, and I didn't go any further than that. And, uh, we can completely revive Jurek if we get Gordon, which is Max's gardener, to move to Sindane. So we need to go talk to him so that we can find out what he wants us to do to get him to move there. Because that's typically what happens. You, you talk to somebody to get him to move in, and then they, uh... They give you a list of things that they need in order to convince them to move. Sometimes they need you to build them certain things, and other times they need you to do a task, and sometimes they need you to do both. Here he is. Oh, Max! You've been moping about a lot lately. Are you taking care of yourself? Something I can do for you? What? You want me to go with you on your adventure? Hmm... I'd like to go with you, but this poor tree isn't doing so well. Taking care of the trees and the flowers on this property is my number one priority, you know. If I go off roaming about, I could lose my job. Bet some of the holy water that Priest Bruno sells at the church could fix this tree. But as you know, your father and Priest Bruno are on bad terms. Father'd never give me money to buy for holy water from Priest Bruno. I'm in a pickle. To get Gordon to send Dane first, you have to get him to join you on your journey. If you fulfill Gordon's request, he'll join you on your journey and get on the train. You can check out your quest by reading your notebook located in the item menu. Oh, I, I, I also cleaned up my inventory like a madman. Look how organized this is. Isn't that ridiculous? Oh, and I'm, I'm using these weapons. Don't worry about these weapons. Just, just, they're not, don't even, don't, don't even worry about it, bruh. I'm actually working toward, like, the, the final weapon in the game with, with that setup for each thing. Uh, but we have 20 holy water already, isn't that convenient? But the plan is, I'll use the regular weapons as we progress, and if we come up to a situation where I'm having a tough time getting through it, and I don't want to go back and farm my regular weapons up, to get past it, and we've tried like five times or whatever, then I'll switch to my superpower weapons. Yes, Max, you've done it! Now I can take care of this tree! Thank you, Max. My work is all taken care of for now. Now I can go with you on your adventure. Oh, and don't mention that ho holy water to your father, you hear? Why? I didn't get it from the priest. You can use his abilities from the status command under the characters on the menu. If you recruit someone else to join your adventure, that person will get on the train. Talk to that person inside the train to sw switch him or her in as your third party member. To move one of your train friends into a house, choose Move Person from the door menu of that house. There may be many others willing to join your party, be sure to look for them. Partners in time. That boy got that virus. I'm turning around, cause I just remembered I can recruit Max's father. Max has Faja. Who this is. I bet those man-eating grass have real creepy smiles on their faces. Isn't that just fascinating? No, it's terrifying, actually. I've been poisoned by them before. You should watch who you talk to like that. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, it's pretty fascinating. According to Cedric, you've been off up to something recently. You're good at a lot of things, but on the other hand, you never see anything through. So when you ask for help, it's hard for me to take you seriously just like that. 
I know. Why don't you try to build up this trumpet gun to a bell trigger? Think you can do it? To get Gerald to accept you, you'll have to bring him a bell trigger. You can build up the weapon you've been given, or you can buy a weapon. Oh, wait a minute. I was doing another thing, right? <clears throat> I don't remember the voice I was doing for the... Anyways, you can build up the weapon you've been given, or you can buy a weapon or bring one find in the dungeons. Bring one find in dungeon. Oh, looks like you've gotten pretty good with weapons, too. I don't even need to see you shoot. I can tell by the way you hold it. Okay, I'll help you out. But I'm not doing it for you. I didn't do a time skip, by the way. I just have a bell trigger already. If this town's in danger, I can't just sit here doing nothing. Gerald joins your party. I don't think it's necessary to point out to your kid when he asks you to go on an adventure with him that you're not doing it for him. It's kind of weird. Be my friend. So you saw me at the circus. Pretty cool, right? Not so much a job as a hobby of mine. I have to have a sandbreaker or a chopper for her to decide to come with me, apparently. Alright, so we're back in Sendane, and I'm gonna make a house. I think that's enough. Move people in. I'd prefer a more respectable place to live. You live where I tell you to. Oh. Well, that's not very good. What? in a garden. Yes. There has been a change in the future. Maybe something will happen. Ooh, ominous. Into the house. I forget what Gordon sells. Pretty sure he sells stuff. Plants and flowers only grow as well as you look after them. I could never neglect my babies. Buy Giorama parts. Sells logs, sturdy rocks, and forest dew. Interesting. Logs, sturdy rocks, and forest dew. Let's go see. Something. Hmm? We need to know about a being called Emperor Griffin. We suspect he's a terrible monster who's taken over the forces of darkness. Hmm. He's been playing with reality across the different eras. I don't know what his true goal is, but if we let him keep at it, the whole world may disappear. He even erased you, Jurak, by destroying your origin point. We've got to stop him, or there's no telling what will happen. Jurak, I hear you've been reincarnated many times, but you keep the memories of your ancestors from the distant past. Isn't that right? 
So somewhere in those vast memories, you should be able to remember everything that's ever happened on this planet. You must remember something about Griffin. Who he is, where he is. Please tell us, Jurak, we must know. Griffin. Let's see. That dialogue hurt my head. You must know everything that's ever happened on this planet, since you're a tree that's been reincarnated a few times. I'm afraid I don't remember. I'm truly sorry. My memories must not all be back yet, I guess. <sighs> Sick, dude. Now there should be time for one dungeon. Wait, there hasn't actually, has there? There has? What it how is that a thing? Master Jurek! Master Jurek, do you know about the Rainbow Butterfly? Hmm. Let me see. That's weird. Rainbow Butterfly. I've heard of it. It's a very rare monster. But it's not evil. like to meet it if possible. What should we do? They like the fresh flowers. You'll find the butterfly where the lafresia grows. Really? Please tell us where does that flower bloom? Now there, I'm not sure. If whoops make them bloom ourselves here i'll give you this he sneezed us a lafricia seed That rhymes. You need sundrops. Sundrops? They have the power to speed the growth of green things. Where can we get them? It's a kind of sap the monster Himara produces. You'll have to ask a Himara. Hang on! Ask a monster? That's nuts! How can we talk to a monster? You must think of that. We talked to Master Utan and the Martin fish obtained a badge box. To get a sundrop, first you'll need to do need something that will enable you to speak with the Hamara. Obtaining this item is connected to Giorama development somehow. Work on your Giorama and then check out Jurak's future world. Interesting, interesting. Okay, okay. Alright, we're just about to hit 42 minutes in the recording, so I'm gonna go ahead and stop it here. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, go ahead and give it a like if you feel. And if you enjoyed me, go ahead and give a subscribe. And until next time, take care of yourselves and bye bye.